Let me tell you something you already know. This is Dave Kirloff with the language of hitting.com. I want to add on and expound upon what I mentioned in the previous video. Does your hitting coach relate to your hitting problems? I explained to you a, a series of drills I was doing with our infielders and outfielders where I was acting like the batter and I had another coach throw me uh, pitches and I would hit the balls to different spots in the field to try to recreate a real spin what it, I, an infielder or an outfielder would see during the game. Being new to the drill, I felt a little pressure and felt a little uncomfortable. But once I went back to my principles of timing and just talk about more of the ball, uh, it, the drill for me became a lot easier. So having gone through this experience, when I got back into the laboratory in the batting cages and I'm working with players, I was more sensitive to their needs and more sensitive to their experiences. What I experienced psychologically while trying to do this drill, uh, hitting the balls to different places in the field, to my fielders, was the angst and the pressure of, of you know, getting good results. What the best hitters have internally built into them is not so much thinking about the results while they're in the midst of hitting. Good hitters are thinking about the ball. So that's a pretty general basic statement, thinking about the ball. What's the big deal, Dave? Well, there's a special technique how to teach someone how to think about the ball, and how to look at the, the, the act that we call hitting as a race. And there's a starting line and there's a finish line. And how am I going to organize and control that ball between those two spaces? It starts with understanding as a hitter, I don't want to be just a spectator, an observer, while the pitcher is going through his delivery or her delivery. I want to be an active participant with that delivery. But while I'm actively thinking about the ball while the pitcher is in his or her delivery, and I'm thinking about how I'm going to see it early in the flight path, and I'm using the pitcher's common denominator to help me organize all these thoughts, it becomes much more manageable to see the ball early in the flight path and control the starting line and control the finish line. This helps me to stay organized and manage the ball in its flight path and not leave that state of mind where all I'm consumed about, I'm saturated about, I'm fixated on is the ball. It helps me to, to push away the angst and not even have it in sight or in vision because I'm just consumed with the ball in its flight path. And the result that comes out from, from training hitters to have this, this vision technique and the timing technique that involves all the things I just described to you is this. The hitter starts to realize that the eyes swing the bat. Where I take my eyes is where I will swing the bat. For most people, this is not an easy subject to teach because they don't have the tools and resources how to put together and, and construct this type of composition for a hitter to look at hitting it. But I am so enthused and excited about it because when players come in to see me hit, and I know they're just mediocre hitters, and I know they hardly even practice. So when they come in, in the first couple minutes, I can see that they're not very good. But it's inside of, of minutes that you teach this technique to those, those players, they, they immediately start taking off, and guess what? I haven't even discussed swing mechanics or swing bat planes or, or anything else to that effect. I've just discussed timing and managing this race that we call hitting. Timing the starting line, timing the finish line, using the common denominator, and making sure that the, that the, the composition of the eyes and the adrenaline and the body is all in the world. Players come back, I get reports, Coach Dave, Coach Dave, my son, my daughter is hitting a lot better. Coach Dave, Coach Dave, hey, we're using the music method you taught us about the starting line, the finish line. Coach Dave, I'm using the speed reading techniques you told me about, and my hitting's gotten a lot better. Coach Dave, I'm using this stuff in the games, and I'm not even getting anxious anymore. I don't have that angst. I'm just letting my eyes swing the bat. I love it. So what are you waiting for? Let's help our hitters to be as good as they can be while they're still young, because they're worth it. I have two hitting systems 
video systems online. I have the best hitting drill ever and the world's greatest hitting formula. Make the investment today. You're going to love it. I'm Dave Kirloff, languageofhitting.com.